Hi there, everybody. It's another challenge for these two teams and a challenge for us in the commentary box, as always. I'm Martin Tyler. Alan Smith's with me. Not too much of a challenge, I don't think. It should be a good game, this. And check on the referee, Anna Poltavkina. Terrific uh, entertainment uh, on offer here, I'm sure, as the game gets underway. This is the home team lineup. Here's a chance to attack. Well, oh, good through ball. That looked very good indeed, but the move has broken down. Now Kerr. Now they've got a chance in this part of the pitch. Good challenge from a sliding tackle from the defender. Here's Christian. A lot of defenders between them and the goal, but they've still got the ball. Good position for the cross. A bit of pressure on the player, that's why it's gone out. A natural finisher we've got on view today for Brazil in Christian. Yeah, one of those players that don't need a second invitation. Really, he's one to watch here today. Well, for a period, Alan Marta, who we're going to look at in this match, was the greatest player in the game. World Player of the Year for five consecutive seasons. Well, that says it all, really, Martin, doesn't it? You name it, she's done it. And uh, there's a striker out here for Brazil. A clear danger to the opposition. Not a great cross at all in the circumstances. And pretty easy to cope with by the defending team. Good through pass. Good challenge here. And it goes back. Williams to take the lead. It's a certain goal. Well, here is that earlier incident, Alan. So close. Well, I think the crossbar's still shaking after that drive from close range. And here's the header. That's a great finish for the first goal of the day. Strong head work, really, and a very good goal. Yeah, all she had to do there, Martin, really, was to get a good contact, and the keeper had no chance. That has opened the scoring. 1-0 here. Polkinghorn. Here's Gori. There's some potential in this move. Got the tackle in. Now Tysa. Now Fabiana. To Alves. Doing well to keep the ball. This could be it. Now the shot. Very good stop here. That'll be a corner. <laughs> and here comes the counter-attack. problem until the clearance was made that's a great interception attacking now Kerr supporting player alongside shots off great hands little headed pass then and a shrewd one in strongly oh 
On to the attack now. Mata! And now a throw in. To Ford. Now the Vanna. They've got the ball back by that interception. Good position. They've worked this attack very well into a quite a dangerous position now. Good play, but they've lost the ball now. And the opposition can get at them. Got on the ball in midfield. Well read by the player in that part of the pitch. Good challenge here. Two who's around the uh, crowd for a three-minute add-on, which is what we're going to get for added time to Kerr. Here's a chance to attack. And here's the shot. Referee's given a corner. Free is signal for half time, and it's 1 0 here. It has been. It's match time. Martin Tyler here and Alan Smith with you as always to describe it. And we're looking forward to something special today. Well, I think so, Martin. I hope these two teams won't disappoint us. Adelaide United in our match today against Athletic Bilbao. The lineup for the home side 4 3 3. And they've got natural wide players in that front three with a central striker. I think that's the key because those lads on the flanks. It's quite a complicated job, actually, because they've got to come inside, support the centre forward, and they've also got to funnel back when they haven't got the ball. So, an onus on them. Bilbao's lineup: De Marcos plays with Balenciaga as the fullbacks. Benya plays alongside Raúl Garcia in the middle of the park. Adoris is the main striker today. was a truly fabulous goal well you've got to want to head the ball Martin and this player did and certainly attacked that corner with a lot of desire and 
that has opened the scoring. 1 0 here. And Gower. He'll need to try and get the ball back now. Attacking now. Not rushing it here. Moving from one side to the other. He's blocked that well. Shots on here. It's a poor shot, really, in the circumstances. Here's a replay again of the goal. Well, I don't think it should have found its way in, but give him credit, he did get some power from some distance out. Athletic Bilbao, what are they going to do with it now? Trying to switch on the attacking power in this situation. Out of this! Oh, so close with that header. Oh, he's good at that, isn't he? He really does connect well with those neck muscles. Raul Garcia. Benya. Aduris. What a powerhouse this fella is. Non stop. Yeah, he's a grafter, all right. And uh, he never gives those defenders a rest. Oh, this is great teamwork. Here's a chance. And a chance he hasn't been able to take. Well, it's one of the best opportunities of the match that. And he should. He knows he should have done better. Could be dangerous. Here, the challenge is a good one. And shoots! Well, no scraps for the attackers to feed on from the goalkeeper that time. Hung on to the ball well. A lot of defenders between them and the goal, but they still got the ball. Valenciaga. Mikel San Jose. Now they've got a chance in this part of the pitch. Defender to it first. He got the last touch, the defender, so that will be a corner. It was a very uh, good effort earlier, wasn't that, Alan? Here it is. Yeah, I think it's a classic example of just trying to hit it too hard and you lose your body shape, flies over. The pressure of getting his team level maybe got to him because he's made a hash of it. I just wonder whether at the end of this match they'll look back on that chance as the one that cost them dearly. They mark us. Adoriz. Benya. Good challenge. Into the attacking third. Keeper comes and claims it, and no great risk. Mikel San Jose. Well, that looked promising, but he's been stopped. Well, there's going to be three minutes added on. There will be a minimum of three minutes added on. 
Balenciaga. Mikel San Jose. Well, that's half time at 1 0. Well, the player that we're featuring here has done well. He's certainly been an influence on this first half. Well, he played really well, didn't he? And he got himself a goal to put his team ahead. He'll be pleased with that first 45 minutes.